take you guys on an adventure of a new disease that's plaguing the world. It's called Delayed Reaction Syndrome, or DRS. Now you may not have heard of this before, but this is a very serious illness in many people today. And we're going to take a look at one brave person who is willing to bring his life on the stage for us. The young man's name is Robin. And we're going to take him through what it's like every day to live with this disease. So please, enjoy the show. And remember, people with DRS are people too. How are you feeling today, Robin? I feel good. Alright. So, Robin, thank you for being with us today. Good to be with you. Thank you. Now, are you ready for this interview? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, so, first question I'm going to ask you, in a nutshell, what is it like having delayed hey, reaction syndrome? Are we still on for Friday? Hey, I'm here, right here. I'm talking to you. Oh, you're talking. Are you about doing this again, Robin? The disease that you have. Okay. I'll see you Friday. Delayed reaction syndrome. <gasps> oh, DRS. Yeah. Yeah. What is it like? Ow! Why does my face hurt? You all right, Robin? DRS. What just happened? You all right, Robin? Yeah, I'm fine. It's not that good there, uh, Tom. Uh, not really a good disease. Excuse me, my name's my name Kevin. My name's Kevin. So, uh, Robin, what do you, what's in the game plan for today? I thought we could uh, hang out and just, you know, maybe think about getting my friend Colby and playing football or something like that. How are you? Should be a good time. Oh, uh, okay. Hello? Damn it, Miss Cole. That happens to the best of us. Hello, I'm here with Winona who I understand is Robin's girlfriend, is that correct? Yes. Now, tell me a little bit what it's like to live with Robin knowing he has DRS. So what are you doing today, Robin, right now? My grocery shopping. Oh yeah? Is that all you're getting? Yes. Don't you need more food for grocery shopping? Hard because sometimes he'd be like just staying there and you try talking to him and he's just like and then if you smack him then he's like whoa what happened you know it's like confusing notice if it hurts Robin if he feels different and left out because of this disease sometimes sometimes like we can be like at the dinner table and he's just like sitting there and then everybody's like talking and he's just staring at the plate it's hard 
Hey, what's up, loser? How's it going? What? Hello? Are you gonna answer me? Listen to me. Hey, hey, idiot. Stupid. Pay attention. Hey. Imla. Hey, who's there? Enough of this. Oh, hey, Hi. excuse me. Excuse me, can we talk to you real quick? It'll only take a second, I'm doing an interview right in here. Um, can I get your name, please? Uh, I'd rather remain anonymous, so for the purposes of this interview, you can just call me Mr. X. So, why do you bully Robin like so? Because every time I see him, he just makes me so mad. And I just want to haul off and hit him in the face. Why is that? Because he's so slow. And I don't know. I'm a fast-paced person. And I'm just filled with anger. I just want to hit him so bad. Could this be because of any regress anger you've had as a child? No. It's just because I hate him. He... You want to hit me so bad? Every day when he is at his locker, he sits there and he gets to class late. And he comes in and he sits down and the teacher says, where's your tardy slip? 20 minutes later, he goes, gets a tardy slip, comes back, sits down. The teacher says, give me your tardy slip. 20 minutes later, he goes and hands him the tardy slip. And it's just like, come on. It doesn't take you that long to process information. Hello. I'm here with Colby, who I understand has been Robin's friend for a very long time. Is that correct? So yep, ever since we, we were little kids, we grew up together. Now, when was the first time you ever noticed that he was different? He, he just, from the first time I met him, I always knew there was something weird about him. And when did you find out what that was? I never really found out what's wrong with him. He has DRS? You did not know that. What is DRS? It's Delayed Reaction Syndrome. What does that, what does that even mean? It means his reactions for things like speech and movements and his abilities have all been delayed. Is he, is he gonna die? No, no, he's not gonna die. It's simply a disease that has been crutching many people, which is why I'm Is he... is he mental? You can tell me if he's mental, because I've always thought no, there was a chance. He's definitely not mental. It's just a disease... Hey, what? That's why I'm pulling this thing today, and everybody else. You know what it's like to live with the <laughs> Did tell him to be here a while ago for his portion of the movie. Hi. Hey, buddy. Hey, Robin. I I told you to be here a little bit ago. You're kind of late. What's up, man? I came the fastest I could come. Okay, well that's all right. Now, I'll let you guys sit and chat for a while. I'm gonna go get the crew ready and get ready for your first day. Oh, sorry. It's not a good disease. I just, you know, like, I can't do normal day things. I, I just, um... Okay. So, when was the first time you noticed that you were different? I am not different. I'm specialer than all of you guys. So, let me rephrase that. When did you notice that you were specialer? Uh, my mom kind of pointed it out to me uh, a few years back, you know. I was like 12, something like that, and she said it wasn't good. You know? So you're telling me it took you 12 years to realize you had this disease? No, it only took me like five. But you didn't realize that anything was different until you were 12? I never said that. Okay, moving on. Now, what would you say would be the worst experience you've had with DRS in your life. So where are we going after this? Oh, uh, I don't like it. And, oh, maybe one time when I was, uh,
What? Could you say something? Continue with your story. I can't do this. It's okay to get emotional. You're okay to get emotional. I'm here for you. I need you to tell me when was the first real bad experience you had with this DRS disease. You're okay to get emotional. You don't know me.